More information about yet another mass shooting. We have team coverage tonight. Fox 11's Phil Schumann is gathering reaction to yet another shooting. But we begin with Marla Teas with the latest information on the tragedy. Marla. Just moments ago, Alex and Christine, officials say that death toll rose to 21. As you mentioned and reported, that includes 18 children and three adults, including the gunman. This after that 18-year-old gunman opened fire, apparently indiscriminately, in Inside an elementary school in Uvalde, Texas. Te Texas Governor Greg Abbott says the gunman was shot and killed by responding officers, but not before causing the deadliest shooting at a U.S. grade school in almost a decade. Uh, the shooter was uh, Salvador Romas, uh, an 18 year old male who resided in Uvalde. Uh, it's believed that he abandoned his vehicle and entered into. Uh, the Robb Elementary School in New Valley with, with a handgun, and he may have also had a rifle, but that is not yet confirmed according to my most recent report. Governor Abbott there, as you heard him report, identified the gunman as 18-year-old Salvador Ramos, a local resident of the border town of Uvalde, which is about 85 miles west of San Antonio. The governor says Ramos entered Robb Elementary School approximately 11.30 Central Time this morning with a handgun and possibly a rifle. We're working to confirm that. That map you just saw there gives you an idea of where the shooting happened in Texas. The school, home to second, third, and fourth graders, was inundated by a massive of law enforcement response, which included FBI and Border Patrol agents. It's not immediately clear how many people were also injured, but school officials say there are several injuries in addition to the deceased. So again, that death toll could rise, but officials are certain the threat is over. And at this point, the investigation is leading uh, to tell us that the, the suspect uh, did act alone uh, during this hyenas crime. The motive tonight is unknown, but this truck is believed to be linked to the gunman. And authorities are working to confirm if he was involved in a domestic incident involving his grandmother prior to driving to Robb Elementary School. And this just in, we are learning that the gunman was shot and killed by a Border Patrol agent. This is the deadliest grade school shooting since a gunman killed 20 children and six adults at Sandy Hook Elementary in Newtown, Connecticut, almost 10 years ago. All right, that death toll tonight stands at 21, 18 children and two, three adults, and that does include the gunman, Alex and Christine. Yes.